everyone, T here. This is episode 362 of the N AIDS series that I began December 1st, World AIDS Day 2021. Almost a year now. And uh, uh, video, almost 365 videos. Um, so it's a few more days. On Wednesday, it'll be 365 days. Then this coming December 1st, I do a fundraising concert in World AIDS Day at Cafe on the Hill, uh, Cafe on the Hill, on Eglinton Avenue West, I believe. Um, just Google it if you want to come. But 4:30, 4:30 to 6 p.m. Um, drummer and I are going to be performing uh, 11 songs and talking in between presentation. Uh, so if you want to come out and support a good initiative. Um, we want to help end AIDS besides making amazing music and telling an amazing story Southern Time Band wants to help end AIDS uh, I've been HIV positive since 1996 and we have another openly HIV positive member in our band won't be uh, singing on this coming December 1st but um, the drummer and I will be playing so um, it costs money to get people to rehearse and book off their schedule to do shows and stuff so that's why we're trying to raise some money so that the Southern Tech Bank can just do that uh, beginning in January next year start rehearsing regularly and then start performing ideally by the end of January and and uh, then getting uh, paid gigs in March and able to sustain ourselves self-sustain ourselves by May next year that's the goal those are the milestones we're trying to achieve so um, first it all begins this coming Thursday December 1st so today is Sunday and taking care of my son again on the weekends and chill day with him I got some practicing in at the expense of my son's bum I uh, he told me daddy poopy and I wanted to keep practicing burned his bum he's just like bad father bad daddy so I, he buddy pooed a lot today he pooed like four times jeez <laughs> sometimes he doesn't poo at all so I was like ugh so but when, the, when your mind isn't focused on your child that that when they're that young you know you know something's gonna go wrong and yeah your attention is needed on them all the time well that's why it's tough to, uh, if you're a parent and you have to do stuff and take care of your children at the child at the same time but anyways uh, I'm sure every parent out there uh, preaching to the choir you know this so um, but he's he's doing better his, his health is better and uh, I had a sore throat at the beginning of this morning and um, I was able to beat that back hopefully it's will we'll be any sign of it tomorrow because I have the day to myself um, both my wife and son will be at work and home care respectively and so I gotta practice um, got to get good sleep tonight so I have a voice tomorrow so I can get good practice in because uh, Tuesday night I have a two hour rehearsal with the drummer and then Wednesday night, we have one hour run through the songs before Thursday, we do the hour and a half uh, set for the public. So, um, yeah, this is the first time I've done my songs in this way for the public, not a, uh, not a um, staged event, but it's just seeing how my songs with a drummer, with a with a drummer I've never done this before with a drummer just see how my songs go over with the with the Joe Public right so um, this is a test to see if they can get people to like my music and that's and we're gonna hopefully trying to find somebody to record it um, as somebody on my team she's not available filmmaker um, so yeah so if you know any filmmakers, I gotta find somebody. Yeah, I got network tomorrow. Gotta find out what's going on. 
with the support from the Business Improvement Association in that area. If they're gonna, what kind of support they're gonna give us other than the five hundred dollars they're already giving us to put on this gig. So, so we see how it goes. This should be interesting week. Very interesting week. It's like this is the week. Like I said before, this is like Eminem said it. You have one chance to make it or break it. One chance, right? And um, this, I feel, this is the one chance I have to to finally break on through to the other side, where um, um, you know all this hard work for decades will finally pay off. Anyways, guys, hope you're doing well. I hope you have a good week coming up yourself. Take care. Talk tomorrow.